Hey yo guys, what is going on? It's your boy Mr. Squatch and we are back with some more Ark Survival Evolved Mobile. We are playing on my server, Mr. Squatch PvP Boosted. If you want to come join, it is an open server, so feel free to come join guys. Also, a few quick things. I got a new microphone. Let me know how you like it guys. It picks up a lot of the echo in my house, so I don't know how much I'm going to enjoy it for recording. Um, until I get a uh, screen to go over the microphone, but I figured I'll try it and see how it goes And also if you are not subscribed make sure to subscribe if you enjoy my content smash the like button And always turn on post notifications so you know anytime I go live Today 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 guys we are going to be taking a look at the last few things We didn't take a look at in the other um, in other in the last update video So today I have the battlement saddle I have the most expensive toy, which is the yo-yo you can get. I have the old smelly fish skin, the curved stone battlement structure, and the stone battlement structure, just a, just a regular structure. So first, let's go ahead and take a look at this smelly fish skin. It's a skin to go over any melee weapon. So I'm going to go ahead and equip it to my uh, to my sword. Let's take a look at that. I was kind of curious about this. I don't know how to get these guys. or Well, I know how to get the yo-yo and everything. Um, I haven't bought the Battlement Saddle Blueprint. These are all giving to me from Ark for being a partner to be able to make a video for you guys. So no, I have not bought the Battlement Saddle yet. But okay, let's take a look at the smell. <laughs> oh my gosh. Nice. Let me, let me look at this. Let's look up close. And it actually has like a, a green glow that comes off of it. That is, that's kind of cool. I kind of like that. I think I'm going to keep that on here. Um, I think the way you do it is you... Um, was there some pursuit you have to do? I can't remember. I'm not 100% entirely sure how you get that. But then we have the yo-yo. This one does or increases the um, the mature or how fast a dino matures to 2.1%. But it also knocks, it takes away... It causes hunger to increase 2.7 times. So this would be really nice for griffins because griffins take, even in my server with boosted stats, take like 11 days to fully mature. And griffins don't don't eat a ton, honestly. Like this one right here, he's been, he's almost there. Um, it, it's been quite a few days. Um, so after I hatch another griffin, how'd you get over here? Uh, whenever I have another baby griffin, I will actually use that on them. But that's basically how those work. The one I have in my inventory is, let me see. I believe it's 95 amber, so they are quite expensive, guys. Yeah, 90 or yeah, let me see, 95 amber. The toy paddle is 40 amber, and that one only increases it 1.8. And then you have the toy jump rope, which increases it by two times, and it's only 55 amber. So, but it causes three times hunger. So probably the jump rope would be the best one to get for your amber, um, but it has the most the most hunger. But honestly, the only dinos I would use these on would probably be the uh, this. And I don't want to go ahead and use it on him because it would be a waste. So maybe in a second we will hatch another griffin and uh, we'll put it on there. And in that way I can tell you all in a later video how many days it took for that dino to hatch. Anyway, time for the battlement saddle. I think that was what we needed next. Yeah, we'll go over the battlement walls in a minute. So let's go ahead and throw this saddle on him. Oh wait, he already has a saddle on him. Equip. Ooh, fancy, fancy. Look at that. And this allows you to build walls on. I mean, it's basically like a platform saddle, but it, you got a platform on either side of the mammoth. Oh, I don't know if the battlement walls can fit. I think the battlement walls are pretty big. Let's see. Yeah, those are massive. Okay, that is definitely not fitting. But I know in solo you can put turrets on these. I don't know about... I don't think you can online. Let's actually go try it. It never hurts to try because sometimes, you know, things glitch and they actually work. But I don't think you can put turrets on them online because that I think would be too OP. Ooh, a little bit of a uh, little bit of rubber banding there. My server has been having ever since we fixed the dodo problem, it's still been having a few issues. Okay, let's grab two turrets. Let's run back out here to this sexy, sexy mammoth. Let's hop up on him. Come on. All right, and then let's um, let's see here. Place. So yeah, you cannot place them on on the uh, mammoth and online which is a good thing because that would be pretty pretty op in my opinion um but i do know you can build on them i believe so let's go see let's go get i think i have some metal foundations in here somewhere maybe um there we go 
Uh, we'll just take a couple. That's all we need. Because if you can put a foundation down, you can put walls down and all that jazz, you know. So, let's go ahead. Let me up. Come on. Sometimes this mammoth does not want to let me up on him. I don't know if he just doesn't like me anymore. I kind of abandoned him the last few days, you know. Ooh, yes, you can. Just like a regular platform saddle. So, that is awesome. I like this. I kind of wish it wasn't a uh, an archetype. You know what I mean? It's, it's $6.99, but you can... I mean, isn't a platform saddle on every other dino just as good? You know? As you can tell, I haven't bought many archetypes, but... I mean, I kind of wish it was just a normal thing you could you could build. It is nice having a um, a platform on both sides. I'm not saying it isn't nice, but at the same time, people don't really use mammoths that often, so I don't see it. I don't I don't know. I just I don't see how that's going to be 100. percent You know, like I guess not like what do you say usable or people are going to like it. But okay, now we got the wall, and I'm most interested about these curved walls. And I can make these in my smithy. It's not a big deal. Um, it's just it came with the code. So why not use them? And man, are these things massive. Let's actually... Let me get on my griffin. Um, I'm going to go make... Uh, or I'm going to go somewhere kind of flat. And we'll put the walls down there instead of here. That way they're out of my base. So um, I'll be back in a few seconds, guys. See you then. All right. We are over by some semi, uh, I guess, flat land. I mean... I guess you could call it flat, but it's kind of the best I found just in the few quick seconds I was looking. I didn't want to go super, super far, so I tried this, but anyway, what is that? Okay, that's a parasaur, and it is running. Why is the parasaur running? Anyway, let's see. Let's go ahead. Oh, I have in my quick slots. So this is the curved wall. Let's put that. Uh-oh, I did two of them. No, can I not pick it back up? <gasps> I accidentally put both of them. Oh my gosh. Okay, well, we'll go ahead and put the um the straight walls. Uh I'm just going to I'm just going to put them wherever. So that way we can at least get a look at them. Wait, why do I still have two straight walls? I just placed them. Whoa. Okay, okay. I think I did a horrible job at building this, but let's fly up and look at it. I think I built half of a circle. Did I really just build half of a circle? I think I did okay um I didn't even complete it man I suck at this anyway guys look at these oh there's the other curved wall dang oh well I should have made extras just in case because I knew I was gonna mess up anyway but I really like to look at these I think I don't think you can build anything over the top of them I don't think you can put ceilings over the top of them um I don't think you can do any of that kind of stuff but anyway, guys, I I, I kind of like these. They're kind of nice. So I think I will maybe maybe build like a dino pin out of them. I wonder if a uh, a gate can can clip onto them, like a big dino gate. That would be awesome. But this is the new battle. Is it called Battlement Wall? I think. Oh uh, well, let's go look it up. Um, let's go to here. Battle. Not battery. Yeah, stone battlement and curved stone battlement. You gotta be level 32, so you got to be the high of a level. Kind of, it's, it's around the same as stone, so it's not that bad. Um, I don't know what they take to craft. I mean, well, I know it's just like stone, thatch, and fiber. Nothing major, just like any other stone wall. But I kind of like them. I think I'm definitely gonna build something with them. I saw some the other day when uh, Warhead that's at my base, he built one as well. But let's go ahead and destroy these because... I don't want to leave random structures just laying around. People are going to be like, hey, why you got a random structure chilling? So, we're going to go ahead and destroy these. Come on. Let's go. Come on. There we go. Now we're going to go kill these over here. It's funny because you hit the kill target button and destroy structures. I'm killing the structures, guys. I'm killing them. All right. Okay. I think that is it for the structures. And we did the... Oh, let's, let's try out the smelly fish skin. Oh, what the heck? He looks like a cow. That Fionia looks like a cow. All right, let's try it out. And dead. Did you hear that sound it made? It made like a squishy fish sound. That was kind of cool. Let's go try that again. Come here, Parasaur. Yeah, it makes like a squishy, squishy fish sound. That is nice. And uh, last time we did talk a little bit about the search features which makes it really nice was probably meeting him because say i wanted to just drop meat out of my inventory or this this guy's inventory will hit search and i could hit meat 
and then I can hit drop and drop all items it'll just drop the meat it won't drop anything else so that's really nice and really handy to have there's been so many times I've wanted just to drop a certain thing out of someone's inventory and I couldn't because you know you can't search so you'd have to drop it uh, one at a time so that's where that search feature comes into play the most for me is being able to drop stuff out of people's inventories anyway guys that is gonna be it for this video kind of a short one sorry um, I don't get my PC until Monday so I'm probably not going to be streaming this weekend. But once I get my PC, it'll be awesome streams from then on out. I promise. I promise. But anyway, thank you for stopping by. As I said before, if you are not subscribed, make sure to subscribe. If you enjoy the content, smash the like button. Turn on post notifications. And god dang it, guys. Come on. Comment down in that comment section. Tell me what you think. Let's get, let's get some hype in the comments. Thank you so, so much, guys. Let me know about the microphone, how you like it. Um, I enjoy the microphone. I think it, it's nice because I'm really loud, but at the same time, it does have a little bit of an echoey. But I think once I get a cover to go over it, that should be fine. Anyway, take it one day at a time. Peace out. Tell me pretty lies. Look me in the face. Tell me that you love me. Even if it's